The beginning, a singularity. The Big Bang Theory proposes that around 13.8 billion years ago, the universe existed as a singularity. This singularity was a point of infinitely high density and temperature, containing all the matter and energy that would eventually form everything we know. Inflation, a rapid expansion. According to the theory, the singularity underwent a period of incredibly rapid expansion called cosmic inflation. This inflation is thought to have happened in a fraction of a second, causing the universe to balloon outward at an unimaginable rate. Cooling and particle formation. As the universe expanded, it also cooled rapidly. This allowed the fundamental forces, like electromagnetism and the strong nuclear force, to condense out of the primordial energy soup. Subatomic particles like protons and neutrons began to form, building blocks of the universe. A few hundred thousand years after the Big Bang, the universe had cooled enough for protons and neutrons to combine and form the first atomic nuclei, primarily hydrogen and helium. These simple elements are the most abundant in the universe today. Over vast stretches of time, gravity played a key role in clumping together the sparse clouds of hydrogen and helium gas. These clumps eventually collapsed, forming the first stars and galaxies. Over billions of years, the universe continued to evolve, with stars living and dying, enriching the interstellar medium with heavier elements, and giving rise to new generations of stars and planetary systems, like our own. There's a lot of evidence supporting the Big Bang Theory. Here are a few key pieces. Cosmic Microwave Background CMB This faint echo of radiation from the Big Bang pervades the entire universe. It's considered strong evidence for a hot, dense early universe. Redshift of galaxies. Most distant galaxies are observed to be receding from us, with the farthest ones moving away the fastest. This is consistent with the idea of an expanding universe. Abundance of light elements. The Big Bang Theory successfully predicts the observed ratio of light elements like hydrogen and helium in the universe.